Well, obviously, you're not interested in getting married to him, so I just get back out there and say, no. Thanks for that chat. Sure. Um, yeah, maybe you should wash our hands first. Yeah. <sighs> you look lovely, by the way. So, where did you get those shoes? <laughs> Uh, yes? You know they'll cost extra, right? Sure, no problem. Okay, so we're both under the covers. Having sex? Yes. I, I mean, no. It would only look like we're having sex. No sex? No. No sex of any kind. So, the camera will be on a timer. When the light stops flashing red, I'll leap forward as if I'm trying to stop it from happening. Like... And you'll look up at the camera as if you're totally surprised. Like, go, ha ha! Why? So it looks like we've just been caught having sex. Why did he have to propose? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe because he loves you? Yeah. Look, Rachel, I'm sorry, but I'm not... When did you send that letter? Um, I was... I'll tell you when. Never! Okay, look, let me explain. When I went to see Lewis, he told me what really happened. I know, and he told me too. And I get it! I'm not good enough. But what I can't understand, Mike, is why you didn't have the courage to tell me that yourself. Look, he lied to you. I thought he deserved a chance to tell you himself. Alright? When I went to his office to get him to sign the letter. Wait. Have sex. Then you can oh. take as many pictures as you like. No, I could never have sex with a prostitute. <sighs> oh, oh, no offence. None taken. Hmm. The same way you just told me. <laughs> so, facing each other and... Preferably out there at the table. Ugh, you're right. Look, I suggest order a bottle of wine. Maybe, if you like red, start with the uh, Grace Farm Cab Sav, or a white, the Hayden Estate Chardonnay. Those are locally made in uh, Margaret River. Then I'd move on to the seared prawns with watermelon and zucchini flowers and for a main, the linguine spanner crab, or if you're a kind of steak girl, order the sirloin with kipler potatoes. And then, you know, finish up with a delicious creme brulee with a trio of donuts. Those are our specials, by the way. <laughs> right. Oh. Am I making too much of a big deal of this? Of course not. Marriage is not something to be taken lightly, and certainly not on an empty stomach. Besides, the longer you wait in here, the more awkward it's going to be out there. At the right time, of course. And then BAM! My career would start to move. Oh. Does your wife know about this? Of course. She's rather supportive, actually. Everything! Everyone that I love! Trevor! My grandmother! Harvey! Now, probably in this job! I'm not ready to lose you. Not today. I don't know what you want from me. I never went to Harvard. What? I'm a fraud. <laughs> a young, attractive woman on your arm, it'll get plenty of people talking. Yeah, but that's not a scandal. I know, but you don't want to ruin your reputation completely. Besides, you shouldn't underestimate the power of gossip. I suppose you're right. Of course, I'm still gonna have to charge you the same. Sure, no problem. Hmm. Hey, maybe I can use this as a tax write-off. Oh. That should cause some waves. Now you're thinking. 